sorry about your reading getting eaten by the computer the other day. Sometimes that happens with videos. They get corrupt. The files get corrupted and there's nothing you can do about it. And then also, if you are looking for the tarot class, I've had a lot of people asking me. There's always a link in the, in the description box if you want to learn tarot from me. Yes, all of my monthly readings, um, and there's a bi-monthly, uh, like a, a mid-monthly reading up there too on Patreon. They all go on Patreon, so you want to check that out. Patreon, we also do lives every Thursday night, so that might be of interest. And between now and the end of this month, whichever reading, Air, Fire, Earth, Water, gets the most likes, I am going to do a bonus reading for each of the signs, single zodiac signs, putting it up on YouTube. Okay, I will be doing that. Okay, my darlings, let's see where we go. Got a lot of messages to catch up on. A lot of messages to catch up on. Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. Yep, higher power. Some of you are really getting connected right now. Thinker, 4 and 44, not for you. How about that? Finally tapping in. Finally tapping in. Moving away from the mind and moving toward the heart. So this is interesting numerologically. Higher power is a four. The thinker is a 44. And not for you. You're starting to get more discerning. That's Aquarian energy, the thinker, right? You're starting to get more discerning about what works for you and what doesn't work for you and why because you're in alignment with your higher self now you're getting it you're getting it my darlings I love that that feels pretty good to me that feels like not pretty good feels really good to me because you're no longer relying on your mind your mind can get in the way the higher power that's why we do meditation is to get out of our mind our mind is very powerful but if you can move beyond that and, and be and tap into your guidance, that's what's going to bring you more peace around making better decisions for yourself and just naturally moving in the direction of your soul. <laughs> wow. All right, let's see here. Yep, four of wands underneath, another four. Another four. Let's see where we go. Knight of Pentacles, Virgo energy. King of Wands, dealing with an Aries Leo Sag. Eight of Wands, communicating with an Aries Leo Sag. You guys might be on two different levels, though. Okay? Might be on two different planes. Wow. King of Pentacles, stepping up. That's awesome. Nine of Swords. Hierophant, Taurus here. Wow. Look at you. I feel like you're leveling up, even though it's difficult for you, right? The thinking, remember the mind is driving you crazy. The mind is ugh, ugh, always um, overwhelming your ability to feel. This Aries Leo Sag has, is grounded now. I think you are you're supposed to know that. The Aries Leo Sag is grounded now and able to communicate. So this could be an Aries Leo Sag with some Virgo energy. It could be dealing with another earth sign. Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. So I'll look at fire signs and other earth signs. Seven of Pentacles, Virgo. Seven of Pentacles, oh, look at how beautiful that is. Oh, and then this water. Okay, so, <laughs> la, 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 la. okay. So look at looking really hard at your belief systems around money. Seeing the past and how maybe she is like, look at all those bags she's got. Look at all that stuff, accumulating stuff. It's like you turned your back on your heart to accumulate stuff. Turned your back on your heart. Um, one thing here. Yes, that could be for both. This is for both of you. 
All right. Changing the changing your ways about stuff, about money. This fire. So, so the, the fours, right? Four is the emperor. Four is about structure. And um, the emperor is about hard work. Very Capricornian energy. Um, even though emperor is Aries, it's about leadership, about me, 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 I, I, I. All due respect to Aries. Um, that's what's important. That the emperor understands their action has impact. Can be dealing with an Aries Leo Sag who has learned lessons about that, about, about, um, see, I love this, this, because there's both Virgo energy here. Knight of Pentacles is Virgo and so is the Hermit. But what a different experience the Hermit is. The Hermit is really looking at their old belief systems around money and stuff and things and realizing the heart the heart is the way the heart is the way the heart is the way forward and i don't feel like it's it's not a thing of like necessarily leaving behind leaving behind anything that has positive impact in your life, a home and, you know, it's not really about that, it, but it's about a heart centered approach to that. More confident heart centered approach. All right. Coming through loud and clear judgment, nine of pentacles coming through fast. I feel like this also six of swords moving forward together. I feel like there's a, a, a fast energy here with this other person, this fire sign. Likely they're single. You could be moving away from a water sign. Okay, that does feel to me like nine of swords, hierophant. Like, what am I doing here? Why am I here? Why am I committing to this? You know, I, I, I like the idea of... I, I feel like you're... You, earth sign, you could be making another commitment, just doing it again, like kind of mindlessly to another person, when in fact, the higher power, you're being able to connect into, tap into your truth and see that the old way is not for you, okay? So I think you're stopping yourself from making a mistake here, all right? Because you're it, when you sleep, Pay attention to your dreams, pay attention, because it's like your defenses are down. And so what's coming in is these doubts about moving forward in a relationship too fast, okay, too fast. But also if this relationship is about, if the commitment you're in or getting in, could be another earth sign, if the commitment you're getting in is making you feel like, what am I doing? What am I doing? I don't want to go backwards. I don't want to go back into something like you, the previous relationship you've had, you had could be with a water sign was created completely in the thing of stuff in the realm of stuff. And that's now you're being, um, awakened by your higher power to help you understand that it's, it's a more heart-centered way forward for you. Whew. A more heart-centered way forward. All right, so I see nine of swords here. I see nine, that's nine days, nine weeks. Within the next few months, okay? Within the next few months. Five of pentacles, three of swords, ace of swords, seeing the truth. I feel like this fire sign is the wave of the future. This fire sign is someone who has shown you the truth about being too tied to money or too tied to the old way of doing things, the stuff, and that is what's causing you pain. Ace of Swords, seeing that truth, this person, this King of Wands, is communicating that. 
okay? They have the Virgo energy here. They have the let's move, you know, um, uh, methodically and things like that with passion. They have that heart-centered approach. They're doing the work on themselves too about money or about how much it means. It's like out of balance or something. How much money means is a very out of balance or creating an old relationship, a relationship that is not for you. You might be doing that right now. And you're thinking, you know, like in the middle of the night, you're like, what am I doing? Why am I doing this? There's somebody, there's somebody, fire sign, who is also doing this and seeing what is, uh, that certain things are not for them. Two, you guys are in alignment with what's, what's right. And moving, I feel like you'll move forward together. So let's see where we go here. Okay. Let's see where we go. Um, I'm going to look at another earth sign. I'm going to look at this fire energy here and this truth that is coming out. This person could be a, you could be looking back to the past about a person who was, who was still single. Could be looking back to the past. They might have been hurt by you. You might have hurt them. And I think you're going to hear the truth about that. Okay? So let's see where we go. Let's see where we go. Fire signs, earth signs. I might even look at this water sign here. Okay. All right. Link is below for you, earth signs. I'll see you over there.